Hello, another very quick, quick reminder on how to use Microsoft PowerPoint. Uh, first thing I want to do is I want to change my background to black. That way it doesn't uh, detract from the pictures that I'm going to put on or the images I'm going to put on for my visual story. I can change the background by single right clicking on the um, non text box area of my, of my slide and choosing background. Or I can go up to my menu bar and choose from format and choose background. Here it's, uh, is my background box. I'm going to select from the drop down menu. I have some preset colors I have here. I can choose more colors or fill effects. Right now, all of my slides I want to be black. And I'm going to click apply to all. If I click apply to all, every single slide that I put in, when I click new slide or insert slide, will all be black. So it's, it actually is why I'm adding that to my master, but we'll get to that a little bit later. So let's just click apply to all. Um, I really don't need any text because the only thing I'm going to be putting on my slides are images. Although my very first one I may want to go ahead and put a title on. So let me go ahead and just put a title on. Uh, I'm just, for the argument's sake, I'm going to put in the cookie, which was the name of the, the digital story I showed you in class. So I'm just going to go ahead and highlight the cookie, change the font style to white, and now you can see that I can see the white text on my black background. I'm going to go ahead and insert a new slide. Now, I don't necessarily need these default text boxes that, uh, that appeared in this slide layout, so I can just go over here into my content layouts and I'll just click on blank. Notice it leaves a blank. Now I'm going to insert the picture that I previously saved. So I'm going to go up to insert picture. This is from a file. So in this case, I'm just going to choose a random, for the sake of time, I'm just going to choose a random picture uh, inside of my, my, my documents. Uh, I'll choose, for example, our school logo. So here's our school logo. I'm going to click insert, and there's our school logo. And uh, from there, it's not a very good one, but at least there it is, and I can resize it from there. So that's how you insert a picture, change the background inside of Microsoft PowerPoint.